In this tutorial, I'll show you how to freeze layers in specific viewports. Um, you'll notice here that I have a alignment along a set of contours. When I zoom out, you can see this alignment continues on. It's over a specific set of contours. Now, if I go into my uh, layer manager here, you can see again the light bulb shows that this layer is on or off. Now I can freeze or thaw all viewports. So in the specific, in all the viewports, I can freeze that. Again, a viewport is in the layout, specific layout, how that is um, a specific area that I see the, the model through a viewport. Now, if I look here, I can see that uh, some of the contours are on ESO1, and then these other contours are on ESO2. That's the layer that I'm showing you what they're on. Now, if I wanted to go ahead and turn them off, I could go in here and I could turn them off by hitting, um, if I, I hit this bulb, and that's going to turn those layers off. Okay, so it's going to turn those off. I can turn them back on. You can see certain portions of that come back based on what whether or not these are on or off. Now I can also use this not the light bulb but the the sunshine, which is a free a freezer thaw in all viewports. So if I if I click this. This is going to th uh, freeze it in the model space as, as well as in all the layout views, every, every um, option here of the viewport. So again, that viewport here, I'm going to un unfreeze this. If I go to my layout view, under layout view, again, if I click on the outside here, I'm on the basically the paper. But the if I double click inside here, which we call the viewport, this is a viewport into model space. And now... If I'm inside that, again, make sure to click this here. I'm going to um, <clears throat> go ahead and hit uh, select ESO2. And instead of this one, which does it for all viewports, I'm going to select this one, which is just for the current viewport. So you can see I've frozen it just in this viewport. So if I look in Layout 2, it still shows up here, but, only, but not in Layout 1, it doesn't do that because I've frozen that layer in just the specific viewport. Uh, that is how to freeze layers in a specific viewport.